sun. First of all, I'm so grossed out. Where is this hair coming from? Maybe it's like a wig or something, that's fine. Great prank though, also, by the way. Yeah, here we go. Oh! I'm gonna pause that really quick. So she's getting the hair from a, a hairbrush. I guess. I guess it's her hair and it's fine. Is that kind of gross? That feels gross, maybe not. The Elmer's glue just mixed with anything hair related just makes it much more gross. Also, I'm jealous right off the bat. I don't have underarm hair at all. Like, this wouldn't be a prank for me. This would be like, hey guys, I did it, look. They'd be like, well done, you, finally. I'm like, yeah, thanks guys. So let's see what happens with this underarm hair. This one. Oh, Elmer's glue on the chest, eh? Just to add insult to injury, again. Get nothing. The chin too? Oh my God. She's a werewolf prank, step one out of 82. All you need is seven sticks of Elmer's glue and nine hairbrushes. Fake teeth as well. She's done this before, she knows what's up. Oh. Here comes Mr. Cuddleboy. Oh, he's gonna throw, he's not gonna know what's, it's in his mouth! Ew! He's like... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I woke up uh, to all that at the same time, I wouldn't even know where to look first. I would be like... Oh. You got me. <laughs> TikTok. And then we'd have a divorce. All right. You're so pretty and not too fat. <laughs> oh my fucking God, I meant to say far. I'm such an idiot. Yo, Siri is out for blood. <laughs> Imagine that's the first message. Hey, you're really pretty. I see you're a Libra. You like to swim in oceans? That's great. I'm more of a lake guy myself. And you're not too fat. Love it. Okay, that's amazing. I hate autocorrect. Mm. One time Siri changed um, Oshawa to Auschwitz. Mm. Swear to God. And I sent the message too. And I was like, all right, well, that's it. That's my life over. That's actually how I died. I'm a ghost. All right, next video. I had Tinder for only one day and it's mainly because of this conversation. Tinder Hi. after one day. Here we go. Kind of a combo of Bill Cosby and Jared from Subway. Do you get that often? So you're like a you're like a combination between Bill Cosby and Jared from Subway. That is so specific. Hey, you're kind of like a combination between this exact person and this exact person from Subway. Just so you know which person I'm talking about. Uh, I'm the same though. Whenever I have Tinder and shit, like I have no idea how to start a combo. I'm like, hey, you have a dog in your third photo. That's awesome. I had a dog. And you look like Bill Cosby? Ooh, I don't know. That's so stupid. I love it. Oh, I love it. Ooh, a pull over. Do you know this woman? How do you know this woman? Uh, huh? Tinder? Nice. Uh -huh. Going out for a little this date. Your, is your first time out with her? Third or fourth. It's getting busy. It's happening. It's getting serious. Yeah, why is this oh, the first thing you ask? Why do I get pulled uh, over? The only, the only issue is that that's my wife. Pardon me? <laughs> pardon me, sir? Yeah, yeah, you are pardoned. I, I will pardon you. Uh, Pause. See, I'm not... If, okay, if, <laughs> pardon me? Yeah, you are pardoned. I'd be like, no, no, like, what did you say is what I meant. What's, what is going on? This is so scary. You can tell that the cop is like, he was sitting there and he's like, all right, I'm gonna be the coolest motherfucker ever. I'm gonna pull up and be like, how do you know her? And it said, he's like, oh, yeah, you're pardoned. You're definitely pardoned, sir. Your pardon is what you are. All right, he's definitely nervous and upset. I'd be upset too, I'd be crying. But this is just too funny. Uh, I, I this is, like, like, literally no, it's not on you. That's not on you. You're not the one that made a Tinder profile while you were married. Well, he doesn't know that. That's so cringy. Hey, can, I, can I put my hands down? You know, why don't you put your hands out? Why don't you uh, grab her stuff out of the car and you can actually leave. You go he's good, he's free to go. Hop in, hop in, over here, yeah, the driver's side. Keep your hands on the vehicle, ma'am. Ma'am? He reduced her to a ma'am? Uh, yeah, yeah, give me her stuff. Yeah, just, just give me all of her stuff and, you know, I don't have to prove any of this at all. Just give me her stuff and then you just leave the premises immediately. That's all. Wow. I like how he said ma'am too. He's like, no, you go where you are. Ma'am. That's, uh, that's wild. He's, <laughs> hey guys, top 10 ways to get out of a ticket and you won't believe number one. You just have to go on a date with some lady who's been married and then uh, we'll actually go on four dates with a lady who's married and then he'll find you because you know, that's how these things work. Wow, that's, uh, I love this. I love, uh, I don't like cheating, but I like watching when people get caught. That's great. 